evidence that told us about how he said the shift in the dates of the 2015 general. Um, we can't exactly call it decamp. Now, of course, you saw President Obasan Jazi, a football administrator, trained along with their company in Lagos. In the four local government area, good afternoon to you. Thank you for joining My us. My name is Damilola Ayarindi. Everybody's shouting and screaming, oh, Boko Haram, Boko Haram, Boko Haram, here and there. If, by God's grace and when, we overcome that, if we don't look at core issues such as this, political intolerance that breeds political thuggery, it's going to be a vicious cycle. And we're not going to move forward. It's going to be taking one step forward and ten steps backward. Now, a lot of times, President Obasanjo has crowd foul, mm. especially when he's referring to the activities of the PDP. Yes. But how can that kind of person cry foul, considering the fact that he was part of those that brought the party to existence and has been part of their processes in the last couple of years? Why would we have that trepidation that our president, the chief security officer, the, the commander in chief of the yes, Federal Republic of Nigeria, yes. might not be able to answer some questions? I want you to rethink yes. that question and please give another answer in the light of this. Yes. Under his watch, we've had the Farouk Lawan case. Yeah. Under his watch, we've had Uduagate. Yeah. Under his watch, we've had the 20 million missing dollars. Yeah. Under his watch, we've had the jet scandal. Yeah. Under his watch, we've had so many of such, yeah. so many of such instances. These are just a few that I mentioned. Now I want you to answer that question again. Yeah. How have we tackled corruption under his watch in the light of all these cases we've had? Danny, uh, we out a number of uh, allegations. Just a handful. Oh, it does, yeah, 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 okay. The point is this. I'm not saying that there's no corruption in this country. But? And it pains me. You see, it is everywhere. So it is everywhere? You want to listen to me. Okay. When I, I talk of corruption. So grading him on a scale of 1 to 100, under his watch, how would you say we have fought corruption as a nation? We have fought corruption. On a scale of 1 to 100, I'll, under I'll, his I'll, watch. I'll, I'll, I will answer you. <laughs> Happy 55th Independence Anniversary to our beloved nation, Nigeria. You're welcome to our special edition of Political Forum, which is a news and current affairs program that centers on political issues across the nation. The program comes in form of current political issues, tidbits, reports, interviews and commentaries. It promises to be educative, enlightening and entertaining. Do sit back and enjoy this 30-minute program. A very good morning to you. This is the news update. My name is Damilola Ayorindi. Latest reports on the terrorist attack on the Federal College of Education, Kanu, reveals that 17 people lost their lives while 34 people were injured. The Public Relations Officer of the Kano State Police Command, Adenrele Shinaba, said this while briefing journalists on the incident. He said two of the insurgents were killed by security personnel while 15 civilians lost their lives. Teachers in the country have been described as the builders of the nation, the engine room of every child and the foundation of any development. The Oyo State Governor, Senator Abiola Ajimabi, stated this shortly after his investiture as a great grand patron of the Association of Primary School Head Teachers of Nigeria at Ringroot, Ibadan. Staff reporter Abiodun Akikile was there and he files in the details. The Oyo State Chapter of the Association of Primary School Head Teachers. Now, before I go, parents and guardians monitor your children. Don't allow them to join bad groups that threaten the peace of the society. That ends Oyo State today. Good afternoon. Born on 18 July 1918 in the village of Mvezo in the Cape province, Mandela was given the name Rolilala, meaning troublemaker in the local Zosa dialect. His first school teacher renamed him with a Christian name, Nelson. In 1950, Mandela was elected national president of the ANC Youth League and two years later was arrested under the Suppression of Communism Act. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 